the, I mean, the Lynx, obviously, Vasa is a Swedish ship, most famous naval uh, museum in the world. Uh, we've worked closely with the Mary Rose Museum in the UK for many years. And actually, it was British uh, divers who were the first salvagers of the Vasa in the 1600s. Uh, and then, of course, there is a link to Holland, which was the, the ship was designed by Dutch architects, ship architects in the 1600s. And then after she sank in, in, in 1628, actually the, the, we have records that the, the, the cannon were raised uh, and they were sold both in the UK and in Holland and also perhaps in Denmark. So we have this history of the links between the three countries. Uh, and for me, uh, and I think for museums, you know, museums always uh, have to look for what, what is the next stage in their story. So the vase was raised in the 1960s, Mary Rose in the uh, 1980s, uh, and this project gives us an opportunity to, you know, to, to go, back, to go back to the bottom of the Stockholm Harbour and see, did we drop a cannon? Is there still one down there? What else might be down there? It gives us a chance to go through the archives you know, in, in real detail in Sweden, in the UK, in Holland, in Denmark, and see, okay, what happened to them? And then it gives also a big chance for you know, something called citizen science. So this is people who love science, love this type of exploring from whatever age and whatever country, try and help us find that there are cannons scattered all over the world. And probably somewhere there's one from Vasa. So we hope that this will bring people together. It'll be the next stage on the journeys of these museums. It'll teach us things about the 17th century uh, and beyond. Uh, and uh, it'll bring sort of next generations of scientists and historians who get a passion for this type of thing and give, give them projects to get involved and, and enjoy. And hopefully we will find a camp.